Donna Emery from Glover Nursery in West Jordan, Utah. We have a wintergreen boxwood here that we're going to talk about. How to grow wintergreen boxwood. Boxwood is planted all over the country. It's really a durable, hardy plant. You do need to take some extra precautions if you're growing in a very cold climate or like ours, cold and dry climate. To plant this, I may just tidy it up a little bit before I put it in the ground. I'm gonna cut off just a snippet or two of the winter damaged growth that's a little bit bleached. Some people like to prune boxwoods into very neat, tight shapes. I prefer to leave them a little bit more loose and natural looking, but I cleaned it up a little bit. This plant, because it has evergreen leaves, it never goes fully dormant in the wintertime. It's always transpiring water. It's always photosynthesizing. So I'm gonna place this in shade to part shade so that in the wintertime when I'm not watering that often or the ground might be frozen, this plant doesn't dry out. The ground is frozen and it can't get any water up into its leaves. It's going to still lose a lot of, of moisture due to sun and wind. And I'm going to slow that down by putting it in the shade. I'm gonna use a good starter fertilizer when I plant it. This one is a 432. It's an organic fertilizer, that's why the numbers seem low, but there's just as much nutrition in it as if it had been a, a chemical fertilizer with higher numbers. So I'm going to position this in a partly shaded location, give it plenty of room to spread. I'm gonna check the label, see how big it gets. This one gets about three feet tall and about three feet wide. So I want to make sure that I give it enough room to get to that size without crowding other plants. Give it regular water and occasional fertilizing two to three times a year perhaps, most important in spring. And this plant will give you evergreen color year round for many years to come. I'm Donna Emery from Glover Nursery.